Charlie with Webby Tips. Webby Tips are self-help videos for the do-it-yourself web designer. I myself am a do-it-yourself web designer. I started a business in 2012 based on information that I learned myself. The name of my business is Ultimate Business Solutions, and you're looking at a website that I built on my own with WordPress.org. I prim primarily use WordPress.org for my websites, and I encourage you to do the same. Use professional themes. Today I'm going to introduce you to a tool. Most of the information resources and tools that I'll present to you in Webby Tips will be free. Basically because I started my business when I was on unemployment. So that means shoestring. So I didn't have any money. I had to learn a lot of things on my own and find free tools. And so I just want to share a few things with you that I learned myself. So we're going to talk about today the Google Chrome Firebug Light Tool. Light meaning free. And the first thing you're going to want to do is you're going to want to install it. So to do so, simply launch your Google browser and do a search for Firebug Light for Google Chrome. And you'll see it here in this link here. When you click on this link, you'll be taken to this page. And on this page, you will see that it is 100% free to install. Go ahead and install it. And what you will notice when you refresh your browser is that the Google Light Firebug is right here in the corner. That's that little bug that's on your screen. So let me just take one minute to show you how the Firebug works. If I want to activate it, I simply right mouse click and tell and select the item that says inspect with Firebug Light. Now I've already done that here, so I'm going to show you that it is selected. The reason why I use it is if the theme doesn't look exactly the way that I want it, if there's a color change I need to make or a font change or even a size to an element, I need to identify what it is first. So if I take a look, I've inspected this area here that says we will connect you to our customers and you can see it with the firebug inside the console here. Here's the text here. When I look at the CSS style, over here on the right, it shows me that it is white. That's the hex code for white. If I change it to black, you can see that it changes to black. Now we cannot make permanent changes here, but we can get a preview of what those changes are going to look like. So of course black probably wouldn't work for me. But if you wanted to make the change, you could go back into your CSS code in the back in your back office of WordPress and make the change to whatever color that you chose to use. So that's my little demonstration of how to install the Google Chrome Firebug Lite tool and an explanation of its purpose. You're going to install it, identify elements on your WordPress theme that you want to modify, then you're going to go into your back office to the CSS file and make those changes. And we'll have an opportunity to see how those changes are made in CSS and WordPress in another video. But for now, this is Charlie the Pearl with Webby Tips, and I hope that this video has been helpful for you. I encourage you to share this video with others and read my blog, which is all about my experiences and the things that I learned developing my own business, what I learned about internet marketing, designing a web page, and things like that. So please look me up on ultimatebizsolutions.com. And hope this has been helpful. Bye.